because of whatever pressure that went on. Now, whoever was left, you know, the employers generally they tried to increase the working hours to balance the overall productivity of the factory. Now, this was very inhuman. I mean, inhuman in the sense that you know there were amendments that came up, and there were many factories and in certain states like Karnataka and Tamil Nadu who brought up amendment in 2023 also. Uh, where they allowed women to work at night and work uh, overtime over there. Uh, there were 12 hours maximum amount of hours that could be worked on in a particular day if an employee actually did work for 4 days in a week. Uh, I mean, uh, and there were 6 hours work without any interval. Now these were all in human conditions and uh, you know as labor basically is a uh, part of this uh, concurrent list it has been a so called position where centre, you know, uh, unilaterally uh, could not actually uh, create a trust in respect of what the states actually wanted to do. And there was exploitation at every respective level. Everybody will agree to the fact that in India, just because the population is very high and skilled workers, their list is very high, employers, it does not matter for the employers if the employee, due to the over number of hours concerned, they had to leave a work, they were. Uh, I mean, uh, in respective factory could have an, another group of employees uh, who are working on, on, on in their actions. So coming down to few of the cases, because you know, as, as uh, I am basically a lawyer in that.